Hi everyone. I'm sorry. I'm an H, and uh, yeah, I have no excuse. All right. So I'm here to do uh, present uh, presenting for my other colleague and uh, one one from uh, Incheon. So because they are cannot be here due to the visa problem, and here in the case uh, here I will show you uh, one 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 case for for color. Here I want to talk about some uh, this uh, this this uh, this uh, contents background why we are using color and how we use color color's future because our team. Uh, uh, Mm, we, uh, we, I'm from 99 Cloud, and uh, the intro, 99 Cloud and the intro have some guys uh, that are working on corner uh, projects. Here's the background: the big data and uh, and the cloud are, are two are two very popular uh, are two very popular, popular industry field that are currently in the chi in the China IT field. So when uh, the, the intro teams are, uh, are working not in uh, on the big data, but uh, but uh, you know the big data are very very infrastructure infrastructure dependent. So they are uh, they are also very require one reliable and one uh, uh, one one agile uh, infrastructure management system to to support their big data development. So they are uh, they are. So they are meeting the big data and the cloud. The interest ST, STO teams uh, uh, are focused on develop uh, de uh, de develop big data as service solutions, and uh, they are they are also uh, contribute to open open source projects like OpenStack. I think the the Kala and uh, and some some projects they are also working on. So they are, uh, because they are, uh, they are also, the, uh, they are also uh, very active on big data projects such as Bark and Hadoop, and the folks on cloud performance tuning. The big data is the big data needs performance. So they are also collaborate with the global SVs. The 99 cloud is a, is a partner that uh, work with, uh, with along with the Intel. So since we are development team, we are uh, we are facing many uh, many problems or many many uh, we we have many requirements, so, uh, such as we are, uh, since we are doing software development, we are we are uh, we require uh, to do some version control, some agile development uh, deployment, and maybe we need hardware maintenance. Now also we need to quick deploy deploy our uh, our development environment. So that is uh, 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 we well, we have very uh, uh, we are eager to have a very agile uh, infrastructure management systems. I think the motivations, folks, motivations, and uh, why we use OpenStack color? Uh, OpenStack, OpenStack uh, uh, provides uh, multi-tenants, multi tenants features. You know, uh, we, uh, uh, we we just uh, we are uh, we, uh, we are development teams, and um, uh, and uh, every development teams need a an as native environment. So that is very. Very good choice to to uh, to support the multi tenants, and uh, and uh, and uh, on a, on the other side, the doc help us to cover all sort of the dependency issues by using concurrent te technologies. Uh, before the caller, we we also have some puppet or self technology to do the OpenStack deployment, but uh, but uh, but the deploy deploy OpenStack components are mixed together. So they are not easy to to do some um, uh, individual component to upgrade or some. 
do some as, na as nations. So this is uh, uh, called us to do some uh, to do this to to, uh, to use the container to to SNH one component to another component. Also, uh, uh, in a corner, we can also uh, we can also easy to do the maintenance and the upgrade. Sometimes when we are doing our do, doing our development, we found that there are some bug on on the current current version of some of mistake components. How to do upgrade this this individual components? Yes, we uh, we use the call, uh, we use uh, we use the container and the corner to to do the individual component applications. So this is the, uh, the intros, this guys on the keynote to do some, to, to, have, uh, to, have, uh, to have this one, reduce the complexity. This is called as containers feature and the easier deployment. The color is very, uh, to use color, we can very easy to deployment uh, on demand almost like sequence. Rolling upgrade. I have said that if, uh, uh, in, in, a in a cross container technologies, we can very, very easy to upgrade to upgrade an individual component of this OpenStack system. This is our uh, this is our uh, this is the enabled uh, environment by our by our team. Here we have three three pools or three pools of the servers. On the left is the OpenStack cloud. On the OpenStack account, we also uh, we have some normal uh, normal computer to 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 uh, to deploy some uh, some uh, some IT systems, and uh, and in the middle is the safe. We have a uh, we have a big safe safe storage systems. And the OpenStack OpenStack we use we use Cinder to. To uh, to use the self uh, self storage systems. Also, we uh, on the on the right side we have some bare metal bare metal machines. The bare metal machines some uh, uh, we also sometimes we are using the self self storage systems. Uh, in this uh, in this we also use the OpenStack to to bootstrap our uh, bare metal systems. Another is the uh, some other po uh, po uh, some other components are the networks and the management networks, pri private networks, and uh, and the, and and on the northbound is the public network. Okay, um, to use corner Ansible for OpenStack exploration is very is can be concluded into these eight steps. First, uh, we, uh, first uh, on the uh, corner Ansible deployment system, we have uh, one de uh, deployment server. Uh, on the deployment server, we will have Docker Ansible, OpenStack client libraries, NTP server installations, and also on the deployment servers, we we will have to, uh, we, will, we will we will need to access the man, man, uh, manage the nodes while password NAS SSH. So this node must be uh, registered in the local uh, NAND servers. Uh, uh, we can use the simple to edit the ATC host file to do the NAND server resolution. This is for uh, this uh, pre pre requirement on development server. And uh, the step two is to uh, is to do some to to, to uh, do some on the manager's nodes. One, uh, one requirement is just uh, the Docker. We have uh, we need a Docker running on the manager, uh, manager nodes. And the step two is download the Docker OpenStack images on the deployment server. And the step four is to is to start a Docker local registry and the node node each with the downloaded images. And uh, and the, and the step five is to edit multi-node file on inventory. In fact, you can name this file uh, uh, by by any what you want to specify what nodes are talking. Uh, what nodes are taking what roles, such as uh, uh, node one is taking normal computer, and, uh, node two is taking network uh, neutral network roles, such as. 
And uh, step six is uh, to edit the global YAML file to specify or to configure to be installed OpenStack features. Yes, uh, in OpenStack there are many components, in, and uh, in the global in the global YAML file we can specify the what components are enabled and how how to store it. Very, it's very simple. And uh, and uh, in in step seven we can use uh, uh, we can use the call the Ansible command line such as uh, called Ansible prechecks to check the syntax or the or the semantics of this. Com okay. The time up. And start to deploy is is step eight. And then there are some there are some. Uh, there are some features that here we are, I want to talk about. In the globes, uh, globes XML file, we can enable HL settings, and uh, and also we can use the external save and save settings. This is the usage highlights I want to talk. Uh, I, uh, we are we have met during the installation. This is the Maria DB's uh, problems, and the second is the upgrade issues. And uh, also, we have, uh, we, have, uh, we, have, uh, we have we have considered the downgrade issues, downgrade issues. Yeah, uh, if we if we run call the end of upgrade field, how to how to do the downgrade? This is called the future plan. New futures in Okta, uh, Okata. We are, we are, we made Okata stable and uh, support more OpenStack projects. Yeah, and the future plan is called Kubernetes support. Now, the call that we have called Ansible, we also have a call K Kubernetes. We, uh, we also need to do the multi regions. Okay, after that, we can enjoy our life. That's a very simple case study show. I think the time is up. <laughs>